morning, millions of people are preparing to hit the road for Memorial Day weekend, which means state troopers will also be out in full force trying to put the brakes on crashes during what they call the deadliest days of summer. Nine News reporter Brianna Fernandez joins us in studio and Brianna troopers have already seen an increase on fatal DUI crashes this year. Yeah, 10% increase on in what they saw last year. So Colorado State Patrol, they call this the 100 deadliest days of summer. So that's a period between Memorial Day and Labor Day weekend that historically they see a spike in fatal crashes. So take a look at this from 2019 to 2023. According to the Colorado Department of Transportation, there were 54 impaired driving related fatalities during the 100 deadliest days of summer. Memorial Day weekend last year, 479 DUI arrests and during the summer enforcement just last year as well, more than 2000 DUI arrests. So troopers tell me those who are traveling will start to hit the road later today. So they're going to be out patrolling the major interstates, but focusing on an I-70 corridor where they tend to see more drivers heading up to the mountains. The problems just spread across the board from distractions to speeding, uh, people being reckless and careless on the road, and of course impairment always plays a big role in Memorial Day weekend. Colorado State uh, Patrol's current enforcement consists of additional troopers and checkpoints as well. So if you do plan to hit the road this weekend, just put together a safety plan and make sure you have a designated driver. I'm in the studio, Brianna Fernandez for 9 News. We want to keep everyone safe out there on the roads for the holiday weekend and heading into summer. Brianna, thank you.